We're gonna find the secret mermaid. This is a long bridge we're having to walk across and a lot of traffic noise. But you can see the Chicago skyline. There it is. To our left. And this bridge is pretty cool. Yeah. All right, so it should be right up there, right? She uh, in the middle of this. I think I see a seashell. All right, you go right, I'll go left. That's it, just looks like a rock. Oh, okay, you can see her from this side. Got it. Oh, you're just going for it. Let me get down there. There she is. The secret mermaid. Wow. A legend. <laughs> An infamous wow. legend. I know, I don't want to touch it, because, I mean, she's been carved since 1986. That's pretty nuts. That's awesome. So this is not the original location of the Secret Mermaid. Sadly, she was carved into a wall along the beach by four gorilla artists, and they did it in secret. So the four artists who created her actually wanted to create other sculptures around her, including Neptune and other ocean gods, <laughs> if you call it. It took them eight nights to carve her. One of the artists used their daughter's facial features as a model. So she does resemble somebody who exists. Hmm. Looks like there's some fish carved into the top here. Although I think maybe this was the side. She's supposed to be lying on top of it. I don't know. Anyway, she was originally built in Burham Park. And when the Army Corps of Engineers found her in 2000, they originally thought she was some sort of ancient relic that had washed up on shore. The lost city of Atlantis. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it does have that vibe, doesn't it? Little did they know, she's actually very modern. Even some, some waves come around the top here. See, yeah, I think this is the base, and the waves come around the base. She's lying on her side, definitely. Which means there's probably more fish on the other side, which is covered by the ground right now. That's a neat piece of hidden art. A true hidden gem of Oakwood Beach.